The unemployment rate in California is just over 4% for the month of May, down half a percent from April and nearly half what it was in May 2021. But does that mean an end to staffing shortages here at home? Action News Now reporter Chloe Curtis checked in with some Chico businesses to find out. The unemployment rate has started to go down and several shop owners say that the number of job applicants they're seeing has started to go up. At one point, Morning Thunder Cafe went four or five months without seeing anyone apply for a job, but the owner says things have started to look up. Well, we're finally fully staffed. Uh, we've been short staffed for quite a while. Uh, we just have our basic needs met at the moment, um, and we are getting a couple resumes in, uh, mainly for front of the house, hardly any for back of the house, but it's something. Morning Thunder, like many restaurants, has been putting one foot in front of the other following the pandemic. Dee says an increase in staffing has helped with many things. I love having fun at work and uh, it, I think customers really pick up on it as well if you can have a good fun environment. When you're stressed and taxed and having to do two people's jobs, you don't get to uh, have that energy quite as much. Gnarly Deli opened its doors in February and says it's seen a huge increase in applicants since then. That's helped grow its bar, event and kitchen staff. We have the opposite problem of most places where we have to turn people away pretty frequently who are looking for jobs. Nick says he thinks the increase in applicants can also be traced back to the pandemic. There's a lot of people looking for work. I think uh, the pandemic has definitely made everybody um, reevaluate their their place in life and think about what what makes them happy and what what they really are looking for. While many of the businesses I talk to say they're getting more applications, they say there's still a long ways to go before they reach pre-COVID staff levels. In Chico, Chloe Curtis, Action News Now. Coverage you can count on. Businesses we spoke with also say the summer months are usually slower with many Chico State students leaving the area.